watching Let's Chat. As neat as the Tennessee Aquarium right here in our own backyard is, if you've never been to the aquarium after dark, it's a whole other experience. You ought to check it out. Tom Benson is here from the Tennessee Aquarium. He's going to fill us in on that. And we have Sarah Campbell, just like the soup, who's an event <laughs> manager. Sarah, good to see you. You yeah. gave me the line. I didn't make I that know, up. I know. I did. All right, you guys are here to talk about the Aquarium After Dark, which is a pretty cool thing. And the name of the program is called? Nightlife. 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 Yeah. What's involved in Nightlife? Yeah, so it's just a fun opportunity for uh, guests to come in after hours to see the aquarium in a totally different way from 6 to 9 p.m. and have some drinks and do some activities along the way. So just a fun overall evening event. And we should stress this is a adults only event, right? It is yeah. 21 and up. Yeah. 21 and up. What do you get for that ticket price? So you get five samples of different local and craft beers along the way. Uh, you get to participate in some activities, like I said, so we have some trivia questions that mm -hmm. will lead you along the path of the actual aquarium. And you just get an opportunity to be in the aquarium in our freshwater side and really just kind of see the exhibits and the animals in a different uh, setting than you normally would. Even though you don't see a whole lot of windows when you're inside the aquarium, there's just something really neat about being there at twilight yes. or at dark. I don't know what it is. Tom, help it, me out. It, it's always a relaxing experience, but there is something about being there in the evening yeah. and just having a leisurely stroll with your friends or your uh, partner mm -hmm. and just enjoying the atmosphere and the vibe of being in great company with good friends. All right, give me an example about what the scavenger hunt's all about. Well, like I said, so it uh, flows along the traditional tour of the building. Mm -hmm. So there's 10 questions in total. Seven of them will be about the various galleries and some of the species that you find there. Right. And then three of them are going to focus on catfish. Uh, it's actually August is Catfish Month. And so our education team has some curiosity carts that will be there to focus on catfish specifically. And so we have different prizes if you get a certain number of questions right. Um, so it's just, again, it's just a right. fun opportunity for people to enjoy throughout the tour. Very nice. All right, Tom, what else is going on at the aquarium and or the IMAX? We're very excited that at the IMAX 3D Theater this Friday, a new film comes to our giant screen, and that's Animal Kingdom. You know, most of our giant screen films in the documentary realm sort of take a long, close-up look at one species, like Blue Whales recently. Right. Uh, great film, but this is sort of the best of, as the name would imply, Animal Kingdom is looking at uh, all of the animals from insects to mammals to birds to reptiles and amphibians and just uh, fishes and just sort of takes you around the planet these gorgeous scenes close-up macro photography of insects and going to basically all seven continents in this exploration of nature and getting to know how these animals play an important role and I think that um, Chip this can really play into uh, educating our young people. This yeah. is a kid-friendly film, right? and so whether you connect it with, let's go over to the aquarium and take a closer look at the feathers and the scales and all of the beautiful camouflage and color of different animals and their role in nature, or even in your backyard. I mean, I think that with the Seek app, helping you identify some of the pictures that you take of insects. Sure. I'm constantly adding new species to my seek list um, just from being out in the yard and around the flowers and the trees. Guys, I wish we had more time, but we got to leave it there. And I'm assuming tickets, of course, you can always get your IMAX tickets online. What about tickets for the aquarium after dark? Are they still available? They are. They're How much still are available. They? So they're $40 for members, right. 45 for non-members, and we do have a designated driver price for $30 as it well. It is a really cool thing to check out the aquarium. In Anytime. Go ahead and get your tickets right now while you're thinking about it. TNAqua.com. That's TN, I'm sorry, TNAqua.org. TNAqua.org. We'll be right back with more of Let's Chat right after this.